Russian actors made fake video depicting mail in ballots for Trump being destroyed, FBI says. This post received a score of 14,000, with an upvote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. The video used a black actor with a foreign accent, a choice that may be intentional as a way to inflame existing divisions on American soil, according to Josephine Lukito, an assistant professor of journalism at the University of Texas at Austin who has researched Russian disinformation. I was going to say it's insane to what lengths they're going here, but Kamala being elected sure would likely disadvantage Russia in wars. But Putin endorsed Kamala, s. Interesting that this is making bigger headlines, Scott Pressler who is one of those leading the charge for Republicans in Pennsylvania was very quick to debunk the video. Glad there's at least someone bang honest. That's a very rare thing in the Republican Party. It's just a rare thing in general. People forget that just because the USSR collapsed doesn't mean that Russia stopped seeing the US as an enemy. Probably made some Russians see America even worse after the collapse. Putin himself saw it this way. He really resented the collapse, especially the part where he was forced to moonlight as a taxi driver to make ends meet. Putin rues Soviet collapse as demise of historical Russia. Putin is on record as saying that the collapse of the Soviet Union was the greatest tragedy of the 20th century. Not WW2, or even the Holocaust, nor the amount of Soviet citizens who died during that period. Nope. The collapse of the USSR was worse, apparently. Because that's the one that affected him personally, and that's all that matters to him. We need to just cut the internet cables at the Russian borders. It's past time. They have declared electronic warfare on the whole world and the whole world just sits and takes it. Time for the Great Iron Firewall. Russia really likes Trump. That tells us all we need to know about Trump. He's bad for the US and he's bad for the world. If Trump gets in he's 100% stopping all Ukraine support for his buddy. Just remember 2016 and the site, dcleaks.com, Russia made him president by hacking and leaking information and giving it out to the public little by little over weeks. I remember Trump encouraging Russia to keep finding the emails. Many naive voters don't realize the monies for Ukraine are actually feeding many communities in the USW building the tools to support the war. Which equates to jobs in the US. It's not just a plane full of money being given away. Yeah by the way conservatives rail about it you'd think Ukraine had built a bunch of trebuchets and we were just shipping them sacks of cash to catapult towards Russian tanks. The vast majority of military aid gets spent right here in the USA. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.